Hey guys, it's Desi Rez here, and I am in my studio section of my house with my beautiful telescope, my Celestron Power Seeker 127EQ. It's here because it's close to my front door, and I need to take it out all the time to go look at stars. And I just finished up some footage of the moon a couple nights ago using this very scope and this very eyepiece, a moon filter by Celestron, a universal adapter for astrophotography. So that's the three components. The The eyepiece is a Svani 7221 zoom retractable. And most of the footage is within 17 to 21 millimeter. I never went to the seven, which is really close up um, because of a design flaw. Not that I don't love you, Celestron, I love you. And if you want to throw me that, you know, accessory package that's like $157, you can you can do that. I won't mind. There's a bit of design flaw, Celestron. Maybe you and all your smart scientists and engineers there could do, do me a favor and fix this. Okay. You see this part here? And this is part of the telescope, not the eyepiece, the actual telescope. Okay. Now, say I have my phone here and it's looking at the moon, which is about 45 degree angle, okay? And this is the way I have it set up. And I'm zooming out so I can get it nice and crisp and clear and say it has to be right here. Now, I should be able to let go of this so that I could take a nice photo here, right? Or I could look at it or whatever I wanna do. I should be able to let go. I should not be held hostage by the knobs. Look what happens if I don't. Okay, well. You see that? You see how it moved? Okay, the further it goes up though, the worse it is. Mm-hmm. I know it's gravity. I'm aware of that. I live on Earth. I'm not, I'm not stupid. Okay, well that's actually a contradiction. What I was saying was, <clears throat> is there a way to lock this Celestron or other um, astrophotography enthusiasts or um, astronomers? Could you tell me how the frig do I get this locked right here? You know what I'm saying? Like, I just need like a lock in one of these teeth, like a, a wire. I don't know, something that keeps it from obviously doing what I don't want to do, which is, you know, Isaac's third law kind of shit. I'm just not about it. Because now, fuzzy. So that's why in this video, you'll see some shakiness, a little blurriness in and out. Because I had to like hold it there for the majority of the time I was filming because this little design. I feel like one of these should move, pop out. There should be a peg or something. You press it and it locks it in. No, I feel like that was really overlooked. Celestron. Such a great scope. But you know what? You guys can make bank, I bet coming up with something that fixes that problem. You're welcome. So, fix that problem for me, Celestron. Enjoy the moon footage. Like and subscribe, you guys. I will be doing more of these just because it's um, one of my many hobbies. I know, I like everything. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Look at the moon, tell me how gorgeous it is. Guys, I'm out, I really am, I have to go. I have, I have nothing to do, but I have to go. Love you.